Eliminate procrastination forever, anatomy of procrastination. Procrastination is a problem that affects many people and it can be a major obstacle to achieving your goals. If you have a long to-do list of tasks that you want to accomplish, but you get distracted or put them off until the last minute, you may never accomplish them. This can lead to a lack of income and a feeling of being stuck. In this video, we will explore the anatomy of procrastination and show you how to eliminate it from your life forever. Understanding the anatomy of procrastination. To eliminate procrastination from your life, you need to understand its anatomy. Imagine you have a task that you need to accomplish. You can break down the different tasks or needs of knowledge into four quadrants, as shown in the chart. High value and high confidence. If the task is high value and you have high confidence in your ability to accomplish it, you will do it. Low value and high confidence. If the task is low value and you have high confidence in your ability to accomplish it, you will do it, but you are just settling for less. High value and low confidence. This is where people procrastinate the most. If the task is high value, but you have low confidence in your ability to accomplish it, you will procrastinate. Low value and low confidence. If the task is low value and you have low confidence in your ability to accomplish it, you will likely not do it. Improving your confidence to accomplish high value tasks. To eliminate procrastination from your life, you need to improve your confidence in your ability to accomplish high value tasks. The main reason people don't accomplish their goals is that their standards are too low. You need to have a strong desire for what you want to accomplish, and you need to have a plan to get there. Think about all the things you wanted to accomplish in your life that you did not accomplish. Were they things you wanted or things you had to have? If you had to have them, you would have done them, right? Someone put a gun to your head and said you had to do it, and you would have done it. So, the first step is to change your mindset and increase your desire for what you want to accomplish. An analogy to increase confidence. Here is an analogy to help increase your confidence. Imagine there is a bug in your house. You could try to squash it with a fly swatter, but you might miss. That's how most people approach their goals. They put in the effort they think is necessary, but it's not enough. Instead, you could bomb the whole building. This may sound extreme, but it's an analogy. The point is, you need to put in the effort necessary to accomplish your goals. Increasing your confidence in your ability to complete high-value tasks is a crucial step towards overcoming procrastination. When you feel confident and prepared, it's much easier to focus on your tasks and find motivation to complete them. This is especially important for the most difficult or challenging tasks, which can be put off due to fear of failure or feeling overwhelmed. To increase your confidence, it's important to have a strong desire for what you want to achieve. You should be passionate about your goals and motivated to achieve them, regardless of the difficulties you may face along the way. Having a clear and realistic plan is also crucial to maintaining your confidence and motivation. When you know exactly what you need to do to achieve your goals, it's easier to focus and act efficiently. One helpful tip for increasing your confidence is to start small and build momentum. Begin by setting achievable goals and tasks that you know you can accomplish. This can include simple things like organizing your desk or cleaning your house, or tasks related to work or studies. As you complete these tasks, your confidence will grow, and you'll be better equipped to tackle more significant challenges. For example, if your goal is to write a book, start with small steps like creating an outline or writing one page a day. As you progress, you'll gain confidence in your writing abilities and be able to handle more complex tasks, like writing an entire chapter. Similarly, if your goal is to exercise every day, start with small walks or short runs and gradually increase the intensity and duration of your exercise. In conclusion, overcoming procrastination and increasing your confidence is essential to achieving your goals and fulfilling your dreams. By having a strong desire for what you want to achieve, a clear and realistic plan, and starting with small steps, you'll be well on your way to increasing your confidence and overcoming procrastination. Remember that taking action today is the first step to achieving your goals, 
So start working towards your dreams today and don't let anything stand in your way. Did you like the video? Like and follow us for more videos. See you in the next one.